truly have a problem with authority. And uh, any chance I can get to belittle authority, I love to do it. You know, I, I just can't help myself. We both had a conversation one time, I remember, about no man being an island. We both, we both vehemently disagree with that. We believe that some men are islands. Some men prefer to be islands. I know that a large part of John and I are like that. Um, Snake Plissken is that island. Bob Ramey at Epco MC Pictures asked me to make a movie of a book called The Philadelphia Experiment. And I said, well, I have this script in my trunk I've had for since 1973 or 4 called Escape from New York. So I let him read that, and he said, sure, let's do it. A friend of mine from film school told me about this legendary uh, kind of punk teenager that went to his high school, uh, Snake Plissken, Larry Plissken. And uh, he says, what a great name. Just an insane name. And literally the guy said, call me Snake. So I thought, that's a great character. Snake is a great character because I believe in him. I think that he's one of those what if characters. What if you could be like Snake Plissken? You'd, you'd love to kick ass like that. You'd love to just not have a care other than for yourself. Ultimately, he's my, he's my favorite character. Working with Kurt is always a dream. You know, we, we, we work together on Elvis for the first time, and we just, we love working with each other. We have a great time. The producer on the film, Peggy Brotman, had been a casting director, and she said, you know who hasn't been seen in a long time is Lee, Lee Van Cleef. And how cool was he back in the old days, and how cool was he in the spaghetti westerns? And so I met with him, and he was cool. I mean, he is, he is Lee. I'm not a fool, Pliskin. Call me Snake. Lee Van Cleef, to me, was the balancing act that made the movie work for me. I thought that... He had a, he had, I don't know, he had its perfect amount of mirth and seriousness. If ever I had any confusion, I could just think of Lee Van Cleef and I wouldn't have it anymore. And Snake Plissken desperately needed that character. I had to look movie. around for some city that looked like destroyed. It takes place in New York City, but New York was out of the question. We couldn't shoot there. We didn't have the money. We had to find a place that looked ruined, so we found the perfect location, and that was uh, St. Louis, Missouri.